Good morning. We have Ashley Rogers, Miss Elegance International and resident in Middle Georgia joining us. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here today. I'm glad to have you and you have a really incredible event. What is going on? So I am Ms. Elegance International and our internationals is taking place in November the 7th through the 10th in Burr Ridge, Illinois. There we will compete in several different phases of competition or well the delegates will. I get the joy of just watching this time. That's nice. <laughs> yes it is. And so we will crown six new queens. Five will be national titles and then the final will be the international title which is mine. Okay and so what are we you know we're here it's a really big event happening in November but girls and kiddos now can really get involved early. How can kids get involved now? Absolutely. So there are pageants, for Georgia in particular, pageants are everywhere it, and it's prime season time because mm -hmm. it's summertime. But in general, there are also things like tea parties or mm -hmm. mentorships that a lot of pageant title holders hold. And I think that's a great opportunity for children to get involved so that they can see a side that's not competition and kind mm -hmm. of see how queens present themselves after they win and what do they stand for in the meantime and so i would definitely say that if your daughter's not ready to compete get into these events where you have title holders that are actually hosting teaching manners and things like that and so that's a great way for adults get in there and compete mm -hmm. so for us specifically you would sign up through our website fill out the application and then you're sent the information and you fly to illinois come november okay. so i don't when it comes to preparing for that or how are you going to win or things of that nature, you won by being yourself and going in the first mm -hmm. place. And so I think that when you think about it that way, that is how women and children get more involved and start joining the pageant sisterhood. Okay. And so this sisterhood you talk about, for folks wanting to know how do they get involved, how do they come to the event in November, what does that process look like? Can anyone go? Yes. So as long as, you know, you're a woman and you're competing and that is literally it. You sign up, you fill out the you're application just ready to compete and, go. and you're ready to go. They send you the information with the itinerary, the handbook, and they let you know what optionals you have if you'd be interested. And then you get in the car, you jump on the plane and you go. <laughs> okay. And so why is it so important to you that you see these young women get involved? It's extremely important to me because growing up, I had a difficult home environment and school environment. So I would come home to certain things and then I'd go to school to be mm -hmm. bullied and things of that nature because I'm a curvier woman and I was even as a child. And so it matters to me because specifically this system does not care about your size, your skin color, your culture, your nationality. Everybody is considered a queen when they walk in the door. And so because of what I grew up in, I feel like pageantry gave me a safe space and I've always felt comfortable to be confident in what I believe in in my platforms. And that is what pageantry is for me. It was a system and a support that I could not experience anywhere else. And so it is more than the sisterhood of you go, you rock that stage. It's more of what are your goals? What are your life dreams? And I'm here to support you all the way through. I still have friends from when I was 12 years old competing to this very mm -hmm. day. So, so it really is a sisterhood. 